In this video, we'll learn how to configure the Authorize.net payment plugin on JSN Uniform. Make sure the JSN Uniform extension is installed on your Joomla site. Go to your JSN Uniform integration page via the component menu item. Click on the settings button and the Authorize.net payment gateway settings will be shown. Set transaction types to authorization and capture or authorization only. By default, the test mode is turned off, so you need to enter the live login ID and live signature key to the Authorize.net parameters. With an Authorize.net host name, by default this value is available. You can leave it if you are not sure. In this video, we'll turn on test mode and enter the sandbox login ID and signature key to the Authorize.net sandbox parameter. To get a sandbox test account, you should access sandbox.authorize.net. Go to your account page and click on the API Credentials and Keys link. Here you can see your login ID. For the signature key, you may choose to disable the old key. If you do not immediately disable the old value, it will automatically expire in 24 hours. Select New Signature Key and Disable Old Signature Key immediately and click on the Submit button. Then verify your identity, request and enter the PIN to get the signature key. After that, go to the admin site to enter the login ID and signature key. Next is extra options. Here you can set the logo for the payment gateway. Cancel URL. This is the page on your website to which Authorize.net redirects buyers' browsers if they cancel the checkout. Receipt link text is the text for the linker button that directs the customers back to the merchant's site. Here you can also opt to receive confirmation of successful transactions. Archive cancelled transactions, send IP to Authorize.net, select the currency and currency symbol position. Click on the save button after finishing the payment gateway settings. For the next step, we need to configure the settings for the payment integration on the form settings page. Select Authorize.net and don't forget to enable the payment feature for the fields you made the payment on by going to the Design tab. Click on the Save button to finish adjusting the settings and go to the front end to test the checkout. Go to the Payment Form menu item. Select a product, license, and click on the Checkout button. This is the test bill. You can see all the order information. The Authorize.net payment plugin has now been configured. Thank you for watching. Please check our other videos to learn more about how to work with JSN Uniform.